Master plans are excellent tools as far as I'm concerned and having participated in many of them because it, it allows the investor to see this big picture of a country. And that master plan even goes further to look at in other aspects of uh, whether it is legal regulatory framework. What is it that needs to be done to unlock this potential that a country has? And to me, it goes on further to also look at uh, how can local players also participate? And I guess that is what you'd call social capital. Because in the absence of local participation, then there is a cost element by having limited local participation, not developing capacity, and what I would call acceptance. In, in my thinking, it's kind of a de-risking tool in a way. Rather than somebody coming in and trying to wonder where do I start and where do I go and what is in existence in the first place. The master plan is not cast in stone. Along the way, they are live documents, so they get uh, reviewed or revised again. Again, helping the investor to know what is actually happening now.